Along with the growing needs for transportation in the world, there is an ever-increasing number of vehicles that causes numerous issues. Some of these issues are traffic jams, car crashes, and unfortunately, numerous fatalities. One of the ways to solve this issue and to improve the driving experience to make it more reliable and safer is to actually equip the vehicle with the communication capabilities. That means that in such system, a car is able to talk to other cars or to share information with the surrounding infrastructure that could be uh, possible in the previous systems. And all of that is possible if we create a service that is running somewhere in a data center and connect this service to the car uh, in order to, to make more efficient decisions for the car and to create recommendations and instructions for it for the driver and the vehicle. In this way, we can actually improve the quality of, of the driving uh, and also to improve its reliability and safety. But what is the problem in such system? Well, this communication between service and the car needs to be fast. It needs to be smooth and uh, the current network infrastructure cannot meet the requirements for the speed. For example, 4G or, or Wi-Fi that we are all using cannot actually, um, yeah, they, they, they cannot offer us the speed that we need for this kind of communication between car and service. And that is why in this research, we investigate the use of 5G technology and uh, we actually uh, use 5G, but we also further improve the speed uh, by deploying services closer to the users, closer to the cars or so-called at the network edge. Uh, we investigate how and when to orchestrate and manage the resources in the whole network of interest and data centers where the services are running in order to make this communication between car and service smooth and quick. And um, in a similar way, how an orchestrator sets the pace of all instruments and all musicians in one orchestra, our orchestration solution is taking care of the overall health of this network service that is running over there for, for the vehicles. And uh, firstly, we investigate uh, what are the technologies that enable this communication between car and service through the network. Secondly, we investigate and create efficient mechanisms that make smart decisions on where exactly to place the service and what is the right timing to move it from one place to another, taking into account the quality of the service, but also the movement of the vehicle on the road.